Hello everyone and welcome back to the series of Simulink tutorial. Today we will study how to find step response of higher order system in Simulink. For implementation of this, we have a third order continuous time system whose transfer function is G of S. And we will separate the coefficients of numerator and denominator according to the power of S. Now for implementation purpose, we will continue from the last example of first order system in Simulink. You will double click on the block of transfer function and add the coefficients of numerator and denominator according to the transfer function and apply the changes. Now run the simulation and observe the step response in the scope. Use the auto scale option for proper visualization. As the system response is slow, now change the simulation time to 25 seconds and rerun the simulation and observe the output in the scope. Now use the auto scale option and analyze the step response. Thanks for watching the video. This was all about today and stay connected for more videos.